Hi everyone, you can see I have done a small pudding for you and this pudding is different. This is creamy chocolate biscuit pudding which will be really nice and I hope you will enjoy and uh, how to enjoy. You have to prepare and see isn't it. Come we will all join together and prepare this pudding and see how it comes. So we will see how we are going to prepare a custard like. So for that I need three teacups of fresh milk that will be one actually it's one pint. So now the third cup I won't use the whole thing. I will keep half okay put into this and keep it. Milk slightly boil the milk though we boil the milk or not slowly slowly I will put about three dessert spoons three dessert spoons of corn flour mix in that half a cup of milk the milk is getting boiled I will add 60 grams of butter then I need about 80 grams of sugar now all this let it get cooked let it get boiled now in the other half a cup I have put the corn flour and mixed it into this milk itself I will add the gelatin roughly I need two teaspoons of gelatin that also I will add it to the corn flour mixture so that it will get dissolved nicely when we cook it will be easy for us I have put only two and a half cups of uh, milk other half a cup I have put three dessert spoons of corn flour and two teaspoons of gelatin I have put I will add the corn flour mixture with the balanced milk and gelatin keep stirring till it gets thick now what I am going to do is I off the cooker I will put a little vanilla essence first take a little and mix it into this bowl keep this aside I have taken a little into this I will put the chocolate cocoa about three teaspoons of cocoa I will add into the smaller quantity of the custard mixture into this I am going to add the chocolate essence vanilla we put first but now I am adding the chocolate essence only for the chocolate cream into the biscuit mixture I am going to put the chocolate cream biscuit I just crushed it not fully crushed also any any biscuit you like you can use even chocolate biscuit is okay or whatever biscuit we like we can use only thing is without cream mix it nicely I kept a little bit of butter I hope you can remember just a little bit of butter I kept it say about about two teaspoons of butter which I am going to add it to this now what I am going to do is I have taken a pudding bowl half I am going to put into this so now what I am going to do is the mixture half of it I will put it here now I will put the balance chocolate biscuit mixture biscuit is not nicely mixed it but no harm now the cream is coming over it something different that we are making here it will be nice no eggs are being used if you want you can use whipping cream 
that also I am not using. We can do a simple, quick, easy pudding. Now we have done this layers, biscuit layer, then the cream layer like that we have put it. Nothing else and this biscuit I have colored it a little. In green I have colored. Biscuit sticks, just a bit of decoration. Simple as that. Always we can't be making different type of puddings. Now see, this is the best pudding I would say. Uh, there is a creamy chocolate biscuit pudding. Creamy chocolate biscuit pudding. So this will be kept in the fridge. Fridge, not in the freezer. Whenever you want, you can use it. This creamy chocolate biscuit pudding could be used any time. You can have it more at the tea time like or else after lunch is more suitable. Uh, you can serve it after dinner also but then most probably it's good for us to have it after lunch or tea time. It will be nice. So you prepare like this and see how it comes because it's something really nice. You can make it, keep at least for three, four days even you can keep in the normal fridge like, okay, and serve it. There is nothing to worry. So you can see how it looks and of course you can make this and enjoy this type of preparation. Next week, uh, very quickly, I will come back with another episode and that will be really nice. Till then, bye from me now.